Okay, the girls are in bed for the night, and I can finally tell you guys my really good news. Good afternoon, Fountain family. So today is my birthday. <laughs> I am 26 today. It's about 3 o'clock, I think, last time I checked the, uh, the clock. I think it's about 3. Um, I've already been to my OBGYN appointment because I was supposed to get on birth control today and come to find out that uh, the birth control has to be ordered. So I probably won't be able to get it for another couple weeks. Happy birthday to me. Birth control. Yay. Yes. The adult equivalent of a present right there. Uh, <laughs> and then hubby took me to my favorite place to eat for lunch. Uh, it's a um, little restaurant in a nearby town. So, it's been a good day. And then we had a surprise. I'm going to show you guys what else the day has brought us. Because I just don't know what to do. And I just, I don't know, want to share it with you guys. So, give me a second. I'm feeding Andy right now. She got all hungry. And then I'm sure she's going to want to be laid down. Because the poor child has not had a proper nap since we left. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, let me do all that. And then I'm going to show you guys what we ran into when we got home. Okay, so this is what we found outside. It's a little bird. And I've contacted like every animal hospital there is. And they've all advised me to just let him back outside. Let nature take its course. He's got a little broken foot and I really wanted to help him but it's not looking like that's an option. So little birdie's gonna have to go back outside. The birdie pops out. Okay, so I let the bird out and I um, have some cashews over there soaking because I want to make a cheesecake for my birthday. I love cheesecake. Woo! You all right? Anyway, I love cheesecake and since going vegan, well, I mean, it's kind of in the name, cheesecake. So <laughs> I found a recipe that is vegan, but I can't make it all the way vegan because the uh, crust the only options for crust that I have are honey graham crackers so I'm gonna just do the best I can make it as vegan as I can and that'll just be that so instead I'm gonna take the girls outside and let Carly play with her power wheel and she's really gonna love this because she's never actually taken it out in the yard yet so this is gonna be fun <laughs> You're just gonna go in a giant circle? Is that what we're doing? It's a giant circle. Yeah, it's a giant circle. Yeah, giant circle. <laughs> Not trying to steer, just got her foot on the pedal. <laughs> what do you think, Kenley? What do you think? Hey, Carly's! Huh? No, Carly's. That's not Carly's. You share. Well, thank you. That's nice sharing. Thank, thank you, Kenley. You for the fish. The fish. It's for the fish? Huh? <laughs> Poor duck. He got ran over. Oh, the elephant got ran into too. Oh no. Oh no. Carly, steer it! Carly, steer! No, no. <laughs> Did you steer? You need help? <laughs> steer. Steer. You're going to hit the tree. 
<laughs> what are you doing, Pongo? Huh? What are you doing? He says, I want to play and knock the ch children down. What? Steer! Press the pedal. Press the pedal. Okay. What are you doing, Kenley? Is that your boat? That's your boat. Mommy, a boat! Yeah. I don't even know how that got out here because that's actually for the pool, for the tub, but okay. <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah. What are you doing? What? Yeah, boop. No, it's dirt. <laughs> it's not poop, it's dirt. <laughs> you thought it was poop, it's dirt, baby. <laughs> oh, now it's really going. Carly hungry. Yeah, yeah. Hey, this. This. What? Did Sissy take out your hair bow? This. Oh no. I'll have to get you a new one. Yeah. Well now I can't see you. <laughs> oh, you're sleepy. Are you going to go to bed early tonight? 8 o'clock maybe instead of 9? My bed o'clock. The birthday dinner of champions. <laughs> okay, here's the cheesecake. I tried to make it as vegan as I possibly could with the stuff that I had in my <laughs> uh, pantry and stuff. So this is peach and chocolate cheesecake. I'm gonna put aluminum foil over it and it says freeze four to six hours in a refrigerator. I'm gonna put it in my deep freezer and see if I can cut that time like in half and we can have some in a couple of hours instead of four to six. So we'll see how this goes. I don't have a food processor so it looks a little bit chunky but I don't care. It'll be it'll be fine. I just want some cheesecake. <laughs> Somebody woke up. Good morning. Hi, Andy. Gonna take care of this baby girl. And the girls over here are reading. Are you reading? And hopefully we can have a piece of cheesecake before you go to bed. It's not looking, cheesecake. yeah, it's not looking good because it's like almost 8.30, but maybe, yeah, but let's take care of the baby princess, let's take care of hers. So we just checked on the cheesecake and it's barely set, I mean, seriously, the only thing that's set is around the edges, huh girls? So... It's not what I wanted in the slightest. This is leftover from Carly's birthday. We bought this big cake, ice cream cake. cake. Uh, yeah, cake, cake. Uh, and um, uh, we just had a ton left over because basically no one ate cake. So, I'm just going to have leftover of Carly's. You want to sing happy birthday to Mommy? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear mommy. Happy birthday to you. Yay! Hi. Thank you. I appreciate that. Is it Kai? Yeah, that's Carly's. Let's eat some cake.
Okay, the girls are in bed for the night, and I can finally tell you guys my really good news. Um, so, I've actually been doing this for a few weeks now. <laughs> um, I just didn't know if it was going to be, like, really official until, like, yesterday. <laughs> um, I'm going back to college. I start this fall, and I found an online program. It's 100% online to get my dietitian degree. The problem is it's not going to be that easy. You get your dietitian degree, you have to do an internship for, I think, a year or two. I think it's two years. And then you take your test to be registered. Kind of like kind of like nurses when, you know, they graduate, they have to take their test. Or really, any profession that you have to be registered at. You know what I mean. So, I'm starting this journey, and I'm... So excited, a little nervous, because last time I was in school, I did good, but uh, I had a lot of drama in my life at the time, if, as you all know, because, I mean, if you've been on my channel for a while and saw my postpartum depression story, y'all know, and uh, school was really hard during that time. So, my past experience hasn't been, like, the best, but my life is totally different now, and I'm so excited. I just, I can't wait. It took me until I was 26, almost 26 years old, to realize what my passion is. And my teachers wanted me to know when I was in like eighth grade what I wanted to be when I grew up. I can't even tell you guys how much it's changed over the years. I wanted to be an author since third grade. I still would like to be an author. I just, I'm very OCD. And it's to the point to where like, I write something and then I just tear it apart. So I don't even know if that will come true, but I would still like to be published one day. Um, I wanted to be a psychologist. I wanted to be <laughs> so many things, but this is absolutely my passion. I could talk about food all day. I love it. I love finding out how food affects our bodies and what happens when we change our diets. And oh man, it just... I don't know, it fascinates me. I've watched like every food documentary on Netflix that they offer. Like seriously, it's embarrassing. Um because I just love it that much. <laughs> I just I so I'm just I so uh the schedule for my channel is going to change this fall because I have three girls under 3. Carly Kinley and Andy are all very close in age. Plus, I'm in school. Plus, I have to do something with this house so we don't live in a pigsty. And I vlog. I mean, really, could I have one more thing on my plate? I'll answer that in October because I don't want to tell you guys this one, like, right now. Um, because it's, I'm, there's something coming up this fall that I'm keeping under wraps right now. So, y'all will know about it later. But, yeah, I'm about to have so much on my plate it's going to be insane yes like y'all don't even know so vlogging schedule will probably change from monday through friday right now to monday wednesday friday is what i'm thinking will probably happen because i just might have to do that schedule so i just want to let you guys know that's what's coming up i will probably keep my monday through friday um, schedule up until school starts and uh, when my cover art changes and the intro changes because i have to change all of that then you guys will know that the schedule has changed so be looking out for that there are some exciting things happening soon and i will see you guys in the new vlog if you want to follow me on social media the links are down below Bye, guys.